Hello friends, welcome to Electronic Circuit Hub. So today we are going to understand about the simulation of PMOS inverter in an LT spice. How this PMOS inverter works, right? So in the last video, we have understood about the simulation of CMOS inverter. How CMOS inverter works, okay? So basically, it was CMOS inverter was made with a combination of PMOS and NMOS, right? So if you haven't watched that video, uh, please go and watch that video. The link is given in I button, right? So let us understand today about the PMOS inverter, right? How PMOS inverter work? And I will run the simulation and I will show you the waveform, right? All right. So you can see here, let us understand the circuit first. So basically, basically this is PMOS, right? Amben is PMOS. And you can see the source of this PMOS is connected to the 5 volt supply, positive 5 volt supply. And the drain of this PMOS is connected to a resistance called R1 and the value for this resistance is given by 10k right so you can see here this is this is the gate of your pmos and gate is connected to connected to the supply voltage okay so whenever 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 you like how this this pmos inverter works how pmos inverter works whenever your input signal is high at that time your output signal should be low and whenever your your uh, input signal is low your output signal is high that means your whatever is your input signal you are getting inverted signal at your output if your input is low output should be high if your out input is high your output should be low okay so that's what the basic principle of pmos inverter okay and let us now run the circuit simulation and see how it works right so i will go at this simulate button and you can see you can go here edit simulation command for the simulation purpose i selected here the transient and the stop time you can see is here 5 millisecond okay so now i directly go to this shortcut that is run button you can click on it and you can see the waveform here let first you can see here this is input so you can see here this is v in and let us try to find out the v out so this is your this is your v out so you can see here whenever your input signal is high you can see your output signal is your output signal is low here right and whenever your input signal is input signal is low your output signal is high so let me try to maximize the window now you can clearly see let me divide it into two plot pane so first one is input i will drag and drop the output here in the second window you can see this very clearly so whenever your input is high your output is low whenever your input is low your output is high but in this case you can say you know, the output voltage is limited by 2 volt how because maybe that, that might be reason that this pmos inverter is working in the linear region right in the linear region and you are getting the voltage drop across this resistance r bar r1 okay so the voltage across r1 is given by v r1 equals to the the resistance value and current flowing through this pmos okay so hope you you have understood how your pmos inverter works okay and how will you simulate and understand the simulate simulation in the lt spice how will you simulate in lt spice right if you have any further question, feel free to ask me in comment section. Thanks for watching.